female skater, Yuna Kim. And she looked like she didn't miss a beat the other night. That short program performance was her first big international test after two years away from competition. And the reigning Olympic champion passed the test with flying colors. She sat in first place after the short. And we should mention three points ahead of our leader right now, Carolina Costner. This is a beautiful program to the emotional music of Les Mis, choreographed by David Wilson. She has looked almost like a machine in terms of precision in practice. with a triple triple attempt off the top starting with Lutz. Lots of speed, triple Lutz, triple toe, her trademark.
the weight of a nation on her shoulders every time she skates. The reigning Olympic champion with a magical skate in London today. Well, she said she decided she wanted to come back. She said, hey, this is what I'm best at, but truly, this is what I love to do. And she talked a number of times about her Olympic performance and about how that was the only time she had two clean skates in competition. Well, guess what? This is now the second time here at the World Championships in London. Superb in the short, superb in the free skate. Six perfect triples. Perfect execution of momentum up into the air and then that wonderful flow as she opens up, checks the rotation and begins the next jump. She is such a force in our sport and what a wonderful, powerful person to have back into the competitive atmosphere. She talks about the responsibility she feels for Korea wanting to go to the Olympics and take two other skaters with her so they can have a chance to experience an Olympic Games. I don't know that I've ever seen a more technically superior or consistent jumper than Yuna Kim and what a lovely person. A gentle soul. choice was wonderful. I think it suited her personality with the way she's probably feeling right now. A little nervous about entering the, yeah. the world staring at her once again and she could kind of hide in those emotions. There's the leader right now, Carolina Costner of Italy backstage. She was and looking for her second world title and there's David Wilson and what a collaboration for him and Yuna. They've been together through uh, through many years and I've watched them work together and if anybody can make her laugh it's <laughs> him he just they have so much fun together and he really helps her to bring her emotion out on the ice and I agree with you this was a perfect vehicle for her it was a kind of piece of music that could carry her carry her through the nerves and through the emotions that she's feeling of this comeback well, the points to beat, 128. Gee, what do you think? <laughs> Will it be a, be a world record is what I think. Oh, my. Look at that. 20 points to spare. And that is the second highest free skate score ever. So Yuta Kim wins a second world title. This was in London. Well, everyone, it's nice to get reacquainted with Yuna Kim, Olympic champion, world champion for the second time. How much does this mean to you tonight? Uh, it has been very long that I skated in competition in big venue and big crowd, and I'm very happy to skate well uh, here in Canada again. So happy. Thank you. You have talked about the fact that you felt a responsibility to provide other South Korean skaters with the chance to go to the Olympic Games. You've ensured that three will go to Sochi in 2014. How much does that mean to you? I already exper experienced uh, 2010 Olympics with my uh, Korean little skater and then I felt the Olympic is the biggest competition for at all athletes and unforgettable uh, event for all the athletes so I want to experience again with my little Korean skaters and I achieved that so very happy. Congratulations Yuna Kim world champion. Thank you. After a two-year absence, Unikim is back. She wins another world title.